When are you going to start recording? Now? Yeah. Okay, is there going to be voice? Yeah. Okay. Assembly. It's recording what I say now? Yeah. Okay. Alright, here it is. The 11th of May, 2019. We're headed over to the milk barn to get the toys out. Videographer Morgan Rushman is going to take care of this. Yep. He has plenty of experience driving my big F-350. Bob is uh, headed over to my brother's house to get him. And they'll meet us over at the milk barn. We'll get all four. How many? I see one, two, three. We'll get all four cars out. Hopefully, we've brought all the tools, and devices. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, now the 
dozen of them this morning going by famous lunch. Some of the big W900s, dump, triaxle dump trailers. Yeah. Just up 
Yeah. They make a lousy sub. There's nothing in them. There's nothing like them. Nowhere good as a subway. Mm. Looks like one of the idiots behind us trying the long lane now. Yeah. Biggie was there last year, wasn't it? The cross lane? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. I think you should have come in here and checked yourself, John, before. I didn't see that. I... Unless he... Unless he's 
plan or something. Maybe it's that little MG is. There's George Ryan's caddy. Shot that it that one caused that lesser manual. Shot that caused that lesser manual. Yeah. Well, we can get one car out. Yeah. I hear it, hear it? I'll go get my wrench. <laughs> I put that up on top there, that road all the way over here. Jeez. That was on top of Yeah. Crescent once was on top yeah. of the tour box there? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's what I say. <laughs> you said that, that didn't fall off at all. No sense in bringing anything in until we get a hold of Mark. Far, just real close, then I can get by into here. Tight mark up there.
Oh, geez, she's stuck on them. It's a mess of bitch. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, boy. Shine, shine your light in there. No, I'm going to have to... No way to get that. Be my magnet to get that out of there. Yeah. <laughs> Just as and just as wash, we have, have to do wash it over there too. I've got my little. That's why I brought the crescent wrench in case. I mm. uh, should have lights. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty bright. Oh. 
only one. Did you come off at dawn the window or something, George? Did you come off at dawn the window? No. Because there's kind of wood on the tires still. I don't remember putting that stuff on there, do you? done that for some reason. Why would he do that? I don't know. He, he doesn't have the key. He couldn't drive it, right? No. Of course, it's a standard. You think you, why would he push it out? I don't know. Jack stand? He would have had to jack it up? Yes. No, we didn't do that. We certainly had it back far enough. Why did he? Yeah. We backed it up purposely. Uh, So, oh, so we'll just get you we'll get your car ready to go and you can get out of here, right, Mark? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Have yeah. a nice day, guys. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to take two minutes. Why? What's wrong? Well, it's tight. Okay. Now, you know what you're doing, driving oh, this yeah. car, right? I just hit my head on that. <laughs> So what do I do? I wonder if you can get your back end out a little more than you yeah. try to get out, huh? Yeah. If, you're, if you first try to turn it, then you're going to be caught out. You're not going to be able to back up. Right. Oh, you, uh, you're the driver. Do it now. <laughs> <laughs> what am I telling you on how to drive? Yeah. What does he do? Like
Just for show, yeah. <laughs> make, make well, George shows up with his three screwdrivers. <laughs> and when I think of the tool you know, chest that he's got, I gotta tell you, you and George are not unlike me and my brother. Oh, really? Uh, I it's, mean, it's, yeah. it's kind of exactly the same difference of. Uh, well, he got all my mechanical jeans. Yeah, first one out, grabbed them all. I got the mechanical jeans, my brother got the golf jeans. <laughs> You gonna put your plates on? No, I figure with the Navy plate, you know, what cop is gonna give me a hard time? Never somebody up so we'll just swing by your house again okay. mm. but we'll just leave it here till next year we just put one of George's plates on <laughs> take my up we'll stick my plates on there and run the car home come on <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you doing good, Morgan? Yeah, not too bad. We'll just want me to be surprised. Verizon, post office, you really moving around now. Where's your spare? I keep mine underneath the mat. Look down in there. Way down in there. Nope. I took both out. Dumbass. Where's the battery? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I... You want me to kick it in there? Yeah. Can you see it? I've... Well, wait a I minute. Tried. I see it. It's right down there. You see it. Mm -hmm. Right there. I see it. How about a coat hanger? Yeah, right next to the battery terminal. How about a piece of wire, George? What a coat hanger. You know what I mean? I got one of those right next to the license plate. What? Two. Uh, they maybe got the antenna there. We can maybe use. I wonder where. Uh, I don't think you could. You need something to poke it. Yeah. Unless I put it in the 
Sachen. Wow, well, there's a coat hang. That one might be alive. Wow, well, there's a coat hang off of there by the one window there. Wait, here. Aha! <laughs> Maybe. Oh, we gotta straighten out a little more. surgical mask. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Problem is, I can't get both eyes to look down in there. So, my depth perception isn't too good. Come on. Gramps does it again. Ain't good, isn't he? <laughs> oh, Bob, how'd you do that? Magic! We held Morgan upside down by his feet, dropped him down in there. <laughs> He needs it for there, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. That battery clamp was in the back seat. Where I just gotta find the antenna. Mm. Huh? The antenna for the car? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 
what are you doing here? Yeah, yeah Trey. Here, George. Oh, put it, it, put it on, man. Right? right there. Yeah. Got that on a offset, don't, don't you? Yeah. You don't have that in white, white George, the battery itself. Positive positive, dude. No, I'm talking about that it's offset. I didn't think you'd get that, Bob. I didn't either, but I got lucky. <laughs> What'd you poke it, get it with? A coat hanger. You had a coat hanger? Well, no, yeah, it was a piece of oh. wire hanging on the wall over there. I found it and straightened it out. And Mark had pair of pliers and straightened it out and got down in there and hooked it. Oh. <coughs> yeah. People with arthritis, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what gets me? The hardest thing for me is bending over like this just a little bit. Oh, yeah. Like if you're bending over is okay. It's for getting back up. No, I have, if, if I'm like bending over uh, doing dishes at, at the kitchen sink, bending over just that little bit, but what I have to do is I have to lean up against the... I have to lean up against the counter. Yeah. Otherwise, just bending over like that, just yeah. in that position, gets me. Yeah. Are you compressing the disc? Even yeah, you're more just getting point. it in the wrong spot. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. When I was younger, I didn't even know there were compression things back, and I never thought about your back. It's like, no, it's always worked. Of course, it's going to work. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't. Until uh, it starts talking to you. <laughs> well, you notice, and you know what the aggravating part from my perspective, you got all these ailments, you know, I and mean, they're not, thank God they're not fatal, yeah. but they're aggravating. And, okay, you got to, I have ongoing problems with my stomach. Okay. So I'll have problems with my stomach, right? I'll work, I'll get that fixed in six weeks or something like that. And as soon as that goes away, then something else will start to bother me, right? Yeah. So then you'll fix that, <laughs> that one, you'll work that one and get that one done, and you say, oh, now I feel great. A week later, now it's your yeah. foot that's bothering you, yeah. you know? Mm. One of the guys at, at the club had, a, had an expression, he says, it's not, he says, I don't have multiple problems, I just got one problem that keeps moving. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I find that if I don't move too much, uh, I'm in better shape. But mm -hmm. if I move around, my knees, my hips, my back, I, and especially my ankle. I have more... See what you got to look forward to, muscular. Morgan, when you get in your 70s? <laughs> I have more muscular problems, I think, than, yeah. than other things. A lot of my yeah. problems are muscular in nature. Yeah. So I find heat works good, like sitting in the bathtub and relaxing in the bathtub for 20 minutes or a half hour, you know, when you start to have aches, helps out a lot. So I'm on Humira, and that is specifically for the inflammation, so it solves a lot of problems. Without the Humira shots, God, I can't walk up and down the steps to get to the basement. It just, so because of the, because very, of the arthritis. Oh yeah, because I'm, I'm, I'm very thankful for that. It's That's, not rheumatoid arthritis, right? it's osteo. Uh, mine is... There's like 30 different kinds of our Oh, is there? Okay. One of those. The handle moves over onto the last one and sticks to it. Okay, George. Oh, you think it's the lever?
We got to let's put something here. Okay. So you can get over that hump. Okay. And see, don't look, look there. Look right there. And right here. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> thank, thank you, sir. <laughs> can you put them back. Yeah. Maybe. No. Yeah. Oh, that works perfect. I like his cover. I think I'll take that. Don't put that down there. There, go back in there and get that under there. And we should get a piece of plywood here. More, you know, one of those big pieces he's got in the truck. I got a piece back here. How big is it? Yeah, but well, we got to get both wheels. Found it in the driveway, Bob. <laughs> Is it yours from last year? Mm -hmm. Soak it and. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Yeah, I had, you know that tape measure, my old tape measure? Yeah. I had to throw it out. It was, oh, did you? Couldn't do it. Uh, I open it up on the inside and there's 
metal on the inside, there's plastic on the inside, it was all just completely. You put this in the car, George? Yeah, let me uh, put it just throw it over in the passenger seat. Alright. I think we can use these blocks again. Do we need it? Yeah. Why not? Nope, that's for sure. Don't worry, BB. We're coming. Capturing all these seventy-year-old complaints, right? <laughs> yeah, I am. That's what I thought. You sent your video to AA. Without any smirks. Nope. Okay. I'm sure he to won't edit them at all. To <laughs> to where am I? To AARP. That's for the old people. Uh, yeah. Yeah, like it's for old stuff. people, not us. No. <laughs> <laughs> I went out to get the battery for the vet. How that work? But I couldn't find it because the battery was in the vet. That's why I don't go. Did you disconnect anything on your battery? Oh yeah, I always take the negative from the It had you on the oh, yeah. oh okay. Now We should get a, you know, what we should do is get a wire and hook it on the other side of that, so if he drops it, then we can pull it up. But, you know what I always worry about? Puerto Rico. Uh, uh, collisions. Uh, how, many, how many guesses do I need? Dropping stuff down the drain when I'm working in the sink. You know, you always hear, see the, yeah. you see the, 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 the rumors and the stories about women dropping their, their yeah. diamond ring oh, down, yeah. down into the... It's got little screens on her things. <laughs> She's got two screens. She puts one in the dishwasher while the other one's collecting junk. <laughs> okay. We're going to have to jump start probably the Blackbird battery shot. Mike's shot, but. I almost forgot to bring the license plates. <laughs> no, that would have been stupid. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. You know, after all the years you've done this, maybe you should make up a checklist. You'll be 70. I did. You'll you you'll all <laughs> check them all. Yep. Stop smirking over there, don't you? <laughs> yeah. Three things to take with me. Yeah, unfortunately the dust buster thing wasn't the third one I put I thought, oh yeah, that I gotta take that. Okay. So I left the license plate. You know what I do? I put right there mm -hmm. by the doorway when I'm going out there. So in order to get out of the house I got a triple. Uh, I went to my truck. <laughs>
Yeah, you can kind of hear it. He's, he's missing it. The engine's mi it's missing. missing. Or something like that. You and George have an ear for that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That car, that car, and this car, we got four drivers, and I can drive. All right, you guys can each take a car. All right, and we'll follow behind. And I'll follow behind.
work out. We have enough driver to make it all in one trip. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Never has in the past. Well, Morgan does all the logistics on those fuels, right? Yeah. Yeah, actually, he's the, You're the logistician. He's the project man manager. Project he manager. should get paid for it. Project manager. He's the guy that figures out and what everybody has to do when. Good dollar. Yeah, yeah, they make good bucks. Yeah. That's one of the things that has surprised me is how much money people are making now that I've been retired for a while. A metalsmith uh, makes over 120 a year because of the overtime. A union, of course. Oh, but this is a metal vendor. Just the tradespeople are really. I mean, my wife reminded me that anything over a hundred really isn't a big deal anymore. Imagine that's it. like, you know, mm -hmm. yeah, that's what it's supposed to be. Well, the value oh, of the the Louis, Louis Manico's grandson, Bobby Waters, is a union laborer. He's making over thirty bucks an hour. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's and that's nothing. That just and, and Steve is making close to forty, fifty dollars an hour. Yeah. That's where the money is. It's in the trades. Yeah. But you know, the, 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 of course, it's a, they have it's a private business and stuff like that. Right. They, the unions might have some. They still have might have some retirement in the union. But guys that aren't in the union and doing it, like yeah. you said, like Steve, those guys, yeah. you know, you got to no save medical. your huh? no medical. You got to no save retirement. Your, so yeah. you, you're making a lot of money yeah. while you're yeah. working, but then when you come out the end of the pipe. We have to dump fuel into this thing, George? Oh, yeah. <coughs> yeah. Who says I can't do mechanical hey. things? Look at okay, that's it. I'm Boy, this guy has come a long way, George. I, got, I know, man. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Okay, I'm not. That's it. <laughs> I'm not going to take a chance. There's something that has to be disconnected. No, I think it just has to be a part of it. It's just stuck. It's just stuck. Mm. I know. Show off. <laughs> well, well, I think you had it kind of. You did the hard part. Yeah. Well, I think. You can no, I'm good at unscrewing things. Mechanical genes and computer genes and double dipper. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> next one. <laughs> yeah, he's got his nerve, hasn't he? Yeah. It's supposed to be one or the other. I ain't gonna pull it. But I made a lot of sacrifices to get them. <laughs> 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 I don't think I'd be able to compete with uh, the kids getting out of college now with degrees in computer science. It's different. You know, and, and the kids now, you know, they're three years old and they're working on a, like an iPad. You know, playing games, pushing all the buttons. Yeah. Mm. You know, when they're, well, okay. let's yeah. see what's going to happen here. Sorry, I bet they can't keep punch as fast as I can. They don't even know what it is. My my niece were at a party, Christmas party last year, and we're talking about yeah. we're talking about punch cards. And she had no idea what a punch card was. <laughs> in a card, you get punched. Well, it's never, it's never of course, course. When, you, yeah. when you punch in, it works. Yeah. yeah. I mean, IBM 88 cards. They just. Yeah. I mean, they never. Well, what's the 80? I mean, they only had 80. You know, they just. Nothing that was the they get? No, I'm not the. Yeah. Huh? Not enough to make it go. Oh dear. How did this work? Okay. Is that a battery? No, it's a, one of those chargers. 
Oh, that's what? the one I wanted to up at. Yeah. So it's a battery operated starter? Yeah. No, just, just straight on a price from the gas. So you don't have to I just want to see what's going to happen here. Okay. Wouldn't even click. I might have to jump it from my feet. Yeah. Well, what if you let it charge for a few minutes? Won't do it. No? That thing's got a bad battery in it. I won it. So you got another battery that's loose? Yeah, I got my biggie. Oh, so you're just bringing it here? I'm concerned about the damn Corvette running like that. <laughs> I think it's smoothing out though. Maybe it's just tired from the winter. Tired from the winter, yeah. It hasn't woke up yet. <laughs> like, you know, when you get up in the morning and yeah. can't find the This will twist the starter right off the engine block. Okay, that's good. <laughs> that guy came in, uh, a mouse got in the pulley system. And when he pulled the mouse out, it was fossilized by that time. He said, yeah, quite common. Yeah. But boy, I thought, you know, he said the pulley was going slow enough to heat. Does it sound like that one is too smooth out? Yeah. Yeah. I'll shut it off, will you? Yeah. Yeah, that's something. Yeah, it has the... I noticed that the surface engine soon light was on. Yeah, on the little info screen. Something, probably chipmunk. Got the hose. And the guy said, yeah, they, uh, they love to eat the stuff because of the propane. But he got the peppermint stuff and soaked the hose with it. And supposedly it helps to take care of it then. Charger on an airplane. I had it started the other day, but it doesn't. It was like completely dead. This mm. now that new tractor that I've got that replaced the big old black thing. Yeah. Push the button. It starts. What uh, uh, electronic fuel injection. Mm. Wow. Well, what a relief that is. I well, I, I this is a quite old battery, uh, quite old lawnmower, and. Uh, I replaced the battery, but I bought a cheap one from Walmart. And uh, it never really worked out well. I know when you're ready. Switch on. Go ahead, crank it. One of those isn't making contact. Put yeah. this over here. Do it again, George. making contact. It's getting red, isn't it? I think the squeezy thing isn't making contact good right. with the post. Okay. Maybe. Can you like, wiggle it or... I'll get it some more top. Whew. 
tools and their uses. I took it's a that proper tool for the proper job. Yeah. No, this one's sparking. Go ahead. Here, showing my, my bat, battery is showing one ball here. You know, yeah. On this, on this camera. What do your tires look like, Mark? Did you look black? About this ball, around the black, and the hard beach. Check up Rosie's tires, will you? Just kind of look at them. I just want to get that thing out of there. Oh, well, I'm not going to get that thing out of there. What?
Well, they use the fresh air to land the heads on the platters. The platters are spinning, and they have big heads on them. Yeah. And then once the platters get up to speed, they use the fresh air to push the, the heads down to meet the platter after they get spinning. Yeah. Okay. Because if you if they roll it on the platter when it wasn't spinning, they scratched it. And they're spinning, they have a, a film of air in there to keep them floating. Yeah. So there was a compressor in the unit. Okay. And that was part of the compressor. The storage tank for the compressor. And when we when we uh, scrapped those, uh, decommissioned them, sent them to the junkyard, I took the compressor and that tank out of it. Yeah. Brought it home, and my father had it for years <laughs> with the compressor. The compressor itself went to shit. And uh, but so I was going to throw it out. George brought it in, and so he uses it for what he uses it for. Those are big old hard disk for and they're monster machines. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. They used to, the guys used to take the old platters home and make patio, like make a patio. <laughs> A table out of it, yeah. you know. <laughs> Wish I had saved one. Well, I would have loved to have one of those in my last job at the state. You know, just like this. I would have loved to just take that and put it in my pocket for people that were, you know, 30 or 40 years younger than me. They would have died. At the end, used to call it. Oh, help me push, push that guy's MG back into place. Excuse me. Not you. <laughs> 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 okay. So is that your cover, George? The gun for the Mustang? Yes. Uh, wh where's the bag? Where's the bag? Oh, okay, I see it. Screen muff there. Oh, you got your sense in driving the truck both times because it's that gas mileage on that. Yeah. Yeah, we got, we got the tools here. We got the tools to put the plate on with. Got to figure it out? Yeah. Okay, tell me what to do. You guys, you, you and you, each pick a vehicle. Yep. Not this one. That one, that one, and that one. Yep. Drive it over to your house. Yep. I'll follow you. We'll all get in my car. Yep. We'll swing by Mark's house. Pick up this plate. Come back here. Okay. Put it on. He can go home. 
one of you guys take the truck and the other guy can walk and I'll drive my car. Okay. That's not good. Make sure you're driving, I'll have to walk. I've got to get to my company. I'll pick up the rear in case anybody breaks down. Yeah, let me go first with Blackbird just in case he coughs or something. Yeah. Yeah. Try not to spoil it. Yeah. Sean. So. Be over at uh, Georgia. Sean. Sure. Sean, sure. sure, I'm gonna. What do you want Morgan to do? Sean, what do you want Morgan to do? Yeah, take Rosie. I'm gonna have to grab my dash cam. Okay.
body style. Break down? Uh, cardboard boxes. She collects boxes through the year. Oh, I don't know why. I have the same problem. You know, you order so much stuff online now. Yeah. And you get all these boxes, and you say, well, I'll save that box. I might need it. And yeah. in six months, you got, you know, a room full of freaking boxes. Every once in a while, I go down under the stairs there. Yep. Cut them up. That's what I recycle. I did that yesterday. I, right. I must have cut up and 15 up boxes. The thing for the cardboard and punch it. stuff is hard to get rid of. We had an old, big, covered cat litter box. Yeah. How the hell do you get rid of plastic? Yeah. That's... You know what you do? You buy a bag at the town office, yeah. throw it in a bag, and then they'll take it. They just... You know? You don't you have, you have garbage collection? What? Do you have garbage collection? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you break it up, throw it in a garbage can. <laughs> yeah. Oh! You know what I heard? You know how it's so hard to get rid of paint these days? Yeah. My brother told me what you do is you get a, a bag of cat litter, dump the paint into the cat litter, oh, let the cat litter absorb the paint, yeah. and then you throw the cat litter out oh, in the yeah. garbage because that's that's legal. You're not throwing the paint out. Oh, Don't forget to throw your uh, old prescription medicine into that cat litter too. Yeah. Oh, so okay. Don't put it in the toilet. Oh, yeah. That's, oh, yeah. yeah. You might, you might get the fish addicted to heroin, to, not heroin. You see that stuff. thing with the suntan lotion? No. There's like two or three chemicals in it. It's been killing the coral. They just discovered oh. it. It's a dumb crap. No, we're losing coral. It's a terrible coral. Yeah. The Great Barrier Reef in um, Australia has lost hundreds of them. Okay, here's my cynical, cynical statement. Yeah. Civilization is dooming the earth. Oh, no question of it. No question of it. The UN report just released a couple of days ago said that about it. Yep. An extensive report. Yep. Can't wait to get to Mars. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, so we can work on that one. That's right, work on that one. No, it's, it's immense. No question of it. I guess a subset of civilization is industrialization too. Yeah. One of the factors that yeah. are part of civilization. A lot of crap that we throw out now, you know? Oh, it's unbelievable. I was noticing that every freaking day in my house, it's yeah. the garb, you know, the, the, the kitchen garbage goes out, right? The thing is half, three quarters full every day. Priorities. <laughs> yeah, my 3500 Dodge Ram with the Hemi in it. Well, you just gotta buy more tickets, that's, that's all. right. Uh, what was it? What was I it? get that uh, win for life every Monday morning. Boy, I'm not doing good this year. That's the, uh, it was a joke somewhere. It says, yeah, the guy's retirement plan is a scratch off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> They still haven't put the house on yet. Apparently it's going to be a tree build. Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Oh, Bob, on exit four, all the piers are built and they've got the forms off the concrete. Even the one in the center between the yep. lanes? Oh, okay. All three of them are built. Oh, cool. 
So now they'll be closing down one of the north or southbound while they put the steel up. Yeah, I don't see the steel yet. And it doesn't take them long to put it, oh, but no. still, they have to close the traffic. Yeah. Maybe they'll do it at night. Think they'll do it at night? No, probably not with steel. No, do it during the day. They got 787 closed northbound going into Cohoes today. Yeah. I don't know what they're doing. Oh, well, that ought to be sweet when it's done. Try to get home at night. That's what I'm saying. They're turning it into a boulevard, you know. 30 miles an hour. Yeah, 55 miles an hour, major traffic route going yep. nowhere. Yep. That was. Yeah, I seen an article a few years ago. They apparently they built one like that over in Boston too, where they built this, you know, inner city, you know, like 787, that kind of stuff. But they never finished it, so you know, people get on it and it just goes and stops. It doesn't go anywhere, you know. Well, we were talking about it, like the. The uh, Dunn Memorial Bridge, right? Yeah. You know, going in the rent store. Go nowhere. I would have liked to have seen the original plans for 787 and what they had in mind. Well, they, uh, they were saying that uh, it was going to come. That's one of the reasons they built the Sage Tunnel. Sage agreed to pay for the tunnel because 787 was going to go over the top of their camp, campus. 787? Well, part of it. Oh. Well, yeah, there was supposed to be, wasn't there supposed to be some route on the, coming up Spring Avenue too, or yep. around the hill there? Yep, around the... Yeah, around the back of my mother's house. Yep. They were doing maintenance on it? Yeah, they were doing work on the roof. It was leaking water and concrete yeah. was doing this and that. Oh, well, darn. So, and they closed for several days. Yeah, I heard that. I heard the bowling alley burned down North Troy, too. Oh, yeah. Boy, right to the ground. That's been there for a long, long time. I, can't, I can't even picture it in my head where it is. Neither can I. At first, I thought it was the Troy Bowl downtown, but that's not the one. Was it right at the bottom of Northern Boulevard, Bob? I don't know. Well, I have no idea. I don't know. That frosty or whatever it is. I don't know. On Fifth Avenue, right? Yeah. I don't know. The garage is all ready for you. Yeah. Yeah. The poor bed is broken. Oh, no, don't do that. Don't do that. No, he's lying, Connie. Oh, it's going to need a whole new engine. Hi, Morgan. Hey. How you doing? <laughs> okay, Hi, Brad. George. Hi. Hi. I've met him already. <laughs> yeah, we go way back. <laughs> we go way back about what, an hour and a half? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh, so what are you doing? Oh, he forgot his plates. His license plates. Oh. He had taken them off. He was going to turn them in for credit. I know. And store I know them. all about yeah. it. He did oh. not get credit for his insurance. Yeah. yeah. But now he doesn't have to go to the DMV and get right. new plates. That's a, that's a good, that's a plus. How's your back feel, Connie? Uh, it's getting much better. Is it really? Yeah. It, but I ha I could stand a lot longer than I can sit. Yeah. My knee is giving out now. Yeah. And I'm hoping, as I was just doing, I'm hoping to be able to bend, because that was one of my sizes in PT, to just bend all the yep. way over. 
it just relieves it just opens the the hole a yeah. little bit it doesn't it doesn't cure it yeah. i would love to good question yeah. about it still in it take care bye bye morgan bye connie nice seeing you We begin right to wax the floor. That's yeah. the beginning. We well, haven't done the rest of it. Oh, I see. Just testing to see if it was the right product, right? You always do wax your floor with auto polish? Yeah, works good. Yeah. I'll have to remember that. Yeah, it's something that's been passed down through the genes. Yeah. You know, hey, Mark. Right. <laughs> do you get good uh, uh, cell phone reception at your house? I don't, yeah, I think we do. We well, you can see the towers right there. <laughs> yeah. Where's the tower? On the hill over on the other side over there. There's a bunch of towers over there. Well, see, we don't actually use the cell phone. It's oh. an emergency card. Oh, okay. okay. And I would be able to find this bag faster than I found it. Yeah. Find the track. You know, you Where's guys are in the car. In the back. You guys were talking about salaries a few minutes ago, yeah. and as I drive by Duncan's here, and you look at the cars, yep. every freaking car is almost like a new, relatively new car. When I brought you over to the eye clinic the other day, Bob, yeah, I was walking around that parking lot, and that's all. I was, in fact, I was looking at registrations. The oldest car I could find was 2008. Yeah, everything was new. <laughs> Legal and illegal. Yeah. Then you don't see all the people that don't own a car because yeah. the people that are on the bus and Walmart uh, shoppers. I think it's a bigger, big split. Well, what we're thinking with Morgan's car, uh, he's checked a couple. He can get uh, progressive insurance for a 99. Is it that's or the general? Uh, can I ask one of those, probably, probably one of those types of weird combined type of weird insurances? I kind of started with, with the general. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you got to look at all the rest of them, Morgan, and see who can give you the best quote. But I thought it would be like 200 a month or something. And the general is $99 a month. The problem is not with the car. Register that for 40 bucks or something. It's always a problem. Sure. You can get a insurance in his name for $99 a month. It's home free. Yeah, that's great as hell. Age. Until you hit 26. Is it 25 or 26? 25. Well, I, I, yeah, 25. Yeah, 25. You're right. 25, yeah. I think it's 25. Uh, not, look at this, this traffic. Isn't this something? It'll be like, like this all the way down to the road. I don't come over here unless I'm forced to. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday are the worst. Yep. The others are just horrible. These are terrific for work. And it's getting worse every year. What a surprise. Just like, <laughs> <laughs> just like the transportation department right. told the county, hey, this it really need a four lane through there. And they said no. Thank God for Chesney Avenue. Yeah, it's been right over the back. Go to China Mart. Go to Price Chopper. Morgan did some traveling yesterday. Yeah. Bobby went to. Uh, let's see. Where'd you go first, Morgan? Uh, way off. Well, wait. Just right here. Verizon. Yeah. Verizon. Yeah. And then over to. The ball bus from my yep. haircut over near Barbers. Yep. And then can I hop up to my P.O. box <laughs> and just go down.
place to have some freedom. Transportation. And we down to Spring Avenue. We've got spring water around. So, he's trucking all day long. Isn't that cool? How many times do you have to stop and fill the truck up? <laughs> Wise mouth. <laughs> I can get my uh, price chopper discount in there now. I had that one tank bob going out to Mark's and back. So with Morgan running around, I should be all right. I'll get the twenty dollars, twenty gallons in there. Yeah, I gotta get. I, I got my card. I gotta use too my Advantage card and. Uh, but I don't have, I have my five gallon can, it's still friggin' full. Because I haven't been using it. I've got 50 cents and uh, some of it runs out at the end of the month. Well, I, I got some, yeah, I got like 20 cents that runs out at the end of the month. Yeah. So I gotta use it up, so. What I do is usually do is dump five, dump the can into Tim's car and then load with my car with the can. And, get my 20 gallons because you know, I only get like 16 in this at a time you know Man, look at that limo holy shit <laughs> how the hell do they support that thing in the middle I often wondered Bob they must see have the frame some, they must have some super reinforced frame in that I, I, I wonder I, if their business has taken a drop since the accident <laughs> about, yeah, uh, boy, that was uh, something, wasn't it? Was not awful. Yeah. Did they ever actually yeah. say what happened? Not I didn't. Yet. I, I bet the guy was distracted, screwing around, yeah. wasn't paying attention. Because they they said he wasn't there wasn't alcohol involved, right? I think they made that statement. Yeah. He was a uh, he was a. Well, did you capture quite a bit? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, my camera kind of died on me when yeah. I was putting on the way you put the plates on the cars over there. Yeah. You enjoyed your time in the garage, so now, <laughs> now you got to get out and get rained on. Okay, oh, too late. Uh, 
that Lincoln pulled out. We would have had room if he hadn't pulled into the traffic. Yeah, after the dark red car there. Yeah, here we go, right? successful endeavor.
Nee. There. The cars are out for 2019. Yep. May 11th. 